name's Andy. In today's video, we're going to add a mirror to the passenger side of my car. Every time I look over that way, I can't ever see anything coming out. And the rear view mirror isn't always enough of a view, so I need to have a mirror on the other side of the car. Uh, some of you may freak out because I'm drilling into the sheet metal of the door and going to add a mirror. And I know this car didn't come with one, um, but it's this is the 21st century. I need to have a mirror on that side. Um, I can't be bothered to turn my head around and look <laughs> out the back. Um, but anyways, let's get started. So the first thing I want to do is I want to recognize that this mirror, I don't know if it was installed incorrectly or if this is the way it comes from the factory, but um, it's really close to these wing windows. Um, and you have to usually where I have the mirror sitting so that I can use it, it's right where this window, this wing needs to needs to be traveling through here. So what I'm going to do is uh, when we mount the mirror on the other side, I'm going to make sure that we mount it just, just a tick farther back uh, than what we have here. So I'm going to measure, since these doors are the same, they're just mirrored, I'm going to measure from the edge all the way to where this rubber grommet is. I'm going to put a piece of tape down uh, just so I know that that's going to be the same distance and then I'll put a piece of tape down on the metal so as I drill through it I don't chew up the paint any more than I absolutely have to. Um, so uh, let's see how it looks on the other side. So we're going to put the new mirror on, on this shelf here on the car and then we're going to measure back from this edge about where it needs to sit relative to the other mirror but we're going to move it just a little bit farther back so that it misses this window. Let's see where the other side measures up. All right, so for all of us uh, inch people versus the metric people, um, I'm gonna, it looks like we're sitting at about, gosh, it's hard to tell on the camera here, but we're sitting about nine and a half inches from this edge where I can catch the tape on to the edge of this rubber grommet that's underneath the mirror. So on the other side, I need to do at least that, but I might go back just a little bit farther so that the wing will miss the mirror. So we've got the mirror, the plastic piece that the mirror will sit on, and then just two fasteners for it. I'm going to use a 3 30 seconds drill bit to drill the holes for those. Um, it's just a little undersized for that. If I need to, I can go back and chase with a little bit larger bit so that I don't destroy that hole, but what I don't want to do is start out with too large of a bit. All right, so the other side is nine and a half to where this piece would sit. So it's right about there. So we're gonna go nine and three quarters. And uh, so set it right about there. I'm gonna put a piece of tape right there. So, that's going to be the front edge of the mirror piece, and then what I want, I don't, see this, this piece kind of cups down like that, and I want to make sure it's as flat as it can be, I don't want to get it up this way because then it starts to get rounded, and so I want to be right about in this area, and I want the tip of this to be right on the edge of that tape, so this is about where we want it. So, we put the mirror will sit just like that and then imagine this will be tilted somewhere in that neighborhood and the window you know what I bet you I'm gonna have to tilt the mirror like that we're gonna want that that farther back we're probably gonna want that right about in there um, so look, that, that gave us even more. Because this mirror, because of where I'm sitting and uh, the angle, and I'm gonna look at it as, you know, coming from here and wanting to go that way. This is actually gonna be at a, I'm gonna exaggerate it here, but at a steeper angle relative to, you know, where the other one may be. Uh, it's kind of hard to see on here, but it would be flatter. I don't know how to describe that. More perpendicular with the mirror base on the other side of the car because where I'm sitting, but on the passenger side, it's going to have to be more tilted. Um, so let's get a little more 
let's get a little more space in here so that I can really have this mirror have the full range of motion that I needed to have. And we'll probably put it there. Let's see what that measures out to. So, yeah, see, the other mirror was sitting about there. This one's going to be sitting about ten and a quarter. So we're adding three quarters of an inch from where the other mirror is sitting. This one's going to sit farther back. But it's good that we figured that out now. There, that marks the metal right where I wanted those drill bits to go so I know that it'll sink right in there. All right, there's no turning back from this part. Um, <laughs> so, uh, hope you got everything lined up when you do this because this, uh, this is it. I was pushing a little hard on there. Dinged up the paint and the, it's not what I wanted, guys. So um, be careful with that, gosh darn it. better. Man, let's see how bad it really is. Yeah, gosh. Yeah, learn from my mistakes, guys. Right now I'm going to just run the screws in here just to make sure that everything works out good so that I'm not fighting it when I go to put the piece in. Yeah, see, I'm, what I'm noticing right now is as I'm chewing up the paint more, uh, that hole is not large enough. I need to go to the next size drill bit. In my drill case, the next largest bit is 7 64ths. afraid of going too large too fast so we'll just sneak up on it with each drill bit size. All right the next drill bit in my kit is a 1 8 inch drill bit. Don't do that. The screws that they give you are more decorative than anything so I'm going to use a sacrificial screw or whatever, something with a little bit better teeth on it to actually set the threads in, in this metal and I come back and chase it with these screws that came with the mirror. So this piece goes on first. Actually, you know what? I don't know which way it goes first. Um, let me go this way. Okay. And then we can put this guy on here.
you know, this screw is not long enough uh, for this front piece. We're going to have to use a different one. Definitely, definitely clears. Yeah. Now we can position this mirror anywhere we need to. And that window is definitely, definitely clearing. Perfect. Just what I wanted. Now this thing, the, the rubber piece or the plastic piece underneath here, unfortunately it's not a perfect piece. It's, it's, it's not rubber, but it does do the job. It does give a place for us to mount this mirror. And uh, it's good. All right. All right. It's another port on the car. Um, after dinking with this and getting it set so it can be where I need to be from where I'm sitting, it's not perfect. It's not like today's modern cars from years, but it is definitely better than nothing. Um, I would do it again if I needed to. The overall fit of this piece is it's decent. Um, I don't. When I was looking for this, I didn't really see a big difference between this and the next one at a different site. They all look pretty same uh, to me, but I could be wrong. Um, so when you're looking for a mirror, um, if there is a passenger side mirror, maybe look for that, but I wasn't finding one. Also, the mirror, or the window does clear, uh, which is perfect. This is what I was looking for. Um, and uh, we're done with it. So uh, that worked out pretty good. Thanks for sticking with me. We'll see you in the next one. How's that look? Can you see me? <laughs> this isn't gonna work. <laughs> All right. Shift. <laughs> Hi, my name's Andy, and in today's video, we're gonna add another mirror to the other side of the car because I can't see out of that side. Oh, that sounds dumb. Hi, my name's Andy. And on today's video, we're going to add a passenger side mirror to that side of the, to the passenger side. I allow myself to introduce myself. <laughs> like I was saying on the other side, uh, we're going to put the mirror... Oh, that's dirty. <laughs> oh man, that's really dirty. <sighs> you see me? Well... Uh, another mod in the bank, right? Or another mod that, that sounds stupid.